Hi Earth Sign, welcome to my channel. We're doing your um, Monday, November 6th daily love soulmate relationship. I'm sorry, I'm not in my studio. I am away right now, but I am here trying to send you guys your readings. Okay, so let's see what's going on for you guys. November 6th, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Okay, let's see. Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. In the extended reading, we're going to see the situation that, uh, I mean, the feelings of your, of your soulmate, okay, towards the situation. You have your Ace of Swords. You can be connecting with an air sign over here. But this is more of a communication card. So you're talking to someone and just wants to address the truth always. It's all about the facts and details now. But this is also about, you know, how a butter, uh, you know, a hot knife slices the butter. So this can be your energy towards that person because you are really inquisitive. You're really asking for details. You're asking for like, what about this? What about that? Whatever. So it's cutting this person down and down and down and down. Okay, it's like it can be even like a lot of questions, and the person couldn't even answer it anymore. That's what Ace of Swords I'm sensing here. It is a new energy though, so this is you know that maybe before the person is not open to having a dialogue, but this is also that time, that moment that this person that you're connecting with is open to dialogue, open to the communication very positive but sometimes it's just too much like stop doing that okay stop chopping the person down okay you have here the empress card it can be a taurus energy are you but this is venus you know and i'm sensing here someone is as is speaking the truth about their feelings telling them how they truly are who they are in their life this is nurturing this is caring this is someone who just wants good for the person remember the empress card is someone who creates so this person is either creating um, creating more open life communication creating the idea of love towards the other person okay but representative of the eight the swords also is their thought someone here is mentally in love um, but venus is you know <laughs> relationship so you are mentally thinking of having a relationship with someone can be an earth sign over here okay because swords represents our thoughts you have your seven of pentacles the waiting part when things are being put into place when things are already um how to establish it's only a matter of time it's almost like you know if you're pregnant then you know the seed is there and then it, it grows gradually and then you 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 know you basically a soul is born here it's like a relationship is born love is born you know underneath the, i mean with the seven of pentacles through time and patience okay this is when you put your effort in already and then you just basically now well you know it's like once you plant a seed that's it you know you don't you, there is no follow-up the follow-up is like you know it's just like well it's gonna grow when it's gonna grow so you just wait so your idea here can show that you're uh you just want to wait for love to be basically naturally manifested organic <laughs> and you have your page of ones the page of ones energy is someone who is very much enthusiastic about their sexual experience this person really really just loves to have fun this person likes beauty in the sense it's like ooh, you're hot you're you know like this, this is the energy so someone here in the connection is really showing great desire okay enthusiastic desire about the chemistry that you guys are having together okay but as any infant it needs constant attention so this page of wands can be um, you know someone who's messaging you who's very very needy or this is you towards a person being needy because you sense you know it's like yeah well i like this person chemistry basically and then you have knight of cups some people here can be dealing with with a fire and water um you know intimacy wise they're very immature emotionally what emotionally mature knight of cups energy is when someone offers their heart now however it includes spirituality so this person is not just a how is it, relationship material but the person is committed to an a soulful level and this is where you get that connection where you belong so it's and you're feeling this you're feeling love and emotion is that is that a song love and emotion okay love and emotion with this person underneath the seven of pentacles we have here knight of swords someone here can be fighting against their feelings and emotion that's what i'm sensing here or this is an uh, this is an open dialogue about two people who's addressing their feelings who's addressing their thoughts this is about clarification also 
because both are showing that they are basically um, how to say it? They, they're basically more open more going towards it, each other this is this is this is both energy earth sign that is like sh show me your feelings show me your feelings and then i'm sorry for the interruption show me your feelings and then i will show you you know vice versa like you know they communicate with you again okay so i'm going to continue this reading guys and sorry for the interruption with how this uh, f uh person feels towards this